This is part two in the TiVo Little Monster upgrade to linear rails. So what you see in front right now are, uh, these are clips that will go at the top of the towers to clip in the print head in case when you power off it slides back down the rails. These are our, my, my, my uh, alignment for drill holes and I'll show you how those work here in just a second. So here is one of the linear rails with sitting inside the C-channel and I've stacked uh, two of the, I think they're called uh, glide tackles. Anyway, so the black one has the M4 threaded screws for the rods and the red one I'm going to have to grind out the rod connectors because I'm not going to actually use those. Instead, I'm going to use the uh, tackle on this one with the existing uh, belt arrangement. So as you can see, perhaps, it doesn't quite align with the, uh, the bolt holes in the slide, and the slide's fairly centered right now. So <clears throat> I'll have to grind these off probably cut first and grind. So here's one of those plastic spacers that I printed and they go in like this and they fit right over <clears throat> like that. And I'll put another one up at the top. Interesting there. Okay, I was going to say interesting about this uh, that should hold it in place while I drill the three millimeter holes into the channel. Now I'm going to try to tap those. It looks thick enough there on the end. So I'm going to drill it with a 2.5 millimeter drill bit and then uh, use a three millimeter tap to thread it. See if that works. If that works, then I only need uh, eight millimeter long M3 threads to bolt that in. Um, this is the bottom of the tower channel, and that should be the top.